Hey guys, this is Jessica and welcome back to my channel. So I just went to the grocery store and so I guess I'm going to do another keto haul to show y'all what I get at the grocery store. I have my cousin's birthday dinner coming up so I want to lose some more weight before I go so I can fit even better into my dress. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to show you what I usually get and I'm going to tell you how much it is. And if you are a new subscriber, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for liking my channel enough to subscribe to my channel. And if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button. It's free. It doesn't cost you anything. And if you want to get notified of whenever I post new videos, just click the bell right next to it and you will be notified. Also, if you want to add me on social media like Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, definitely add me and let me know where you found me. First items that I picked up was this. This is the Jimmy Dean Simple Scrambles. This is the bacon one. I personally like the bacon one better than the sausage one, so I got a couple more. Um, I'm not a big egg person <laughs> since I was in the hospital for like a month. All they fed me were those eggs and uh, I ended up hating them. So every time I get like a carton of eggs, I feel like it's money wasted. So this is the easiest thing for me to do. And it only has two carbs in it. Um, some people complain because of the sodium or whatever, but it doesn't really bother me that much. Every time I go to the store, I always pick up a couple, so I always have some in my fridge. The next thing I picked up was just some regular lunch meat. I like to get those cheese sheets and put some lunch meat in it and some pickles and just other kind of stuff in it and have a little wrap. So this is the Ultra Thin Rotisserie Season Chicken Breast and it has three carbs in it. So the next thing I picked up is cheese. I am a cheese head and I love me some cheese. So I picked up two um, low moisture part skim mozzarella cheese and it has uh, one carbohydrate per serving. Um, I like to use this to make a skillet pizza, which is just a cheese crust and then um, your sauce and whatever toppings you want on it. And then I also picked up some Monterey Jack cheese. I love to put this on my grilled chicken breast and it is delicious. Then I also picked up some string mozzarella cheese because this is just a really good snack or on the go or just whenever I'm at home watching TV, I can just have one of these. And this has zero carbohydrates. And the Monterey Jack has one carbohydrate also. And along to go with the cheese, I picked up some pepperonis. I love wrapping pepperoni around the string cheese and having that as a snack or making my baked pepperoni chips. Those are really a good alternative to potato chips. If you want to know how I make those, it will be linked down below, but I'll also have it up here somewhere. And the pepperonis have zero carbs. The next thing I got is some chicken breast. This is my favorite kind of chicken. It is the Purdue chicken breast and they are individually sealed. So you can just pull out one or two or however many you need. And it has zero carbohydrates, of course, but I like this because all the chicken are on a vegetarian diet, no animal byproduct, and it's all organic. So this is my favorite chicken breast. These items are new things that I found. Um, I found this. It is called Oh Snap Pickling Company, and they are in their individually dilly bites, which is just a fresh dill pickle snack in cuts. And this has zero carbohydrates, so, and I love pickles, so I thought this would be neat. They have these, and they also have a spicier one also, if that interests you. But I found these at Walmart. And the last new thing I found is this. Now, I don't know if this has been around, but this is also from Jimmy Dean, and it's fully cooked meat lovers, pork sausage, and bacon crumbles. 
and I thought, you know, if you're making an omelet, you could just sprinkle this in your omelet. Um, I got it to top my cheese pizza or even your fathead pizza. You could top this with, and this has only one carbohydrate per serving, which is a half a cup. So that's pretty good, but um, yeah. So I thought I would give this a try also. So that is it for my keto grocery haul. Um, I hope you found something new or different that you wanna try. I will have everything listed down below along with the price of each item. So thank you so much for watching my channel. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you on the next one guys. Bye.